Thank you also for Renosis, Vijay inviting me. Okay, I'm not uh, too long into, uh, with this one. Okay, so let me check where is this? Okay, this is a bit about my background. So uh, actually my company is Centurion Corporation Limited in Singapore. We have uh, about 58,400 pet for foreign workers in Singapore. And we have uh, uh, this one in Singapore and in, uh, sorry, in Malaysia, JB. And we have 3,002 bed in, for the student. But today, I just want to share about what is more to the foreign workers in Singapore and what is the opportunity that we can do. Or the Magento group, we can have some information. Okay, we can, I think I can, I can skip this one. Not uh, too much on this. Because at this moment, we are planning to have a foreign worker application in Singapore. We work with uh, MOM. So we, we have certain of features inside of this. But we are more talking about the e-commerce that we are thinking. It's a bit tough at the first that we are talking about e-commerce. They buy something from the e-commerce. Because sometimes the, they don't have very big limit. Even for the everyday daily meal, they have very limit, uh, small limit for the daily spending. So, okay. This is, I think, the most important and uh, that we can get all this information. Because this information, we did a survey and MOM give this to us. At this moment, they have 770 foreign workers uh, mobile phone and they are using Wi-Fi in the, in the dorm. Like us, we have five dorms in the Singapore. We provide them all uh, with Wi-Fi, free Wi-Fi. And this is all the data that we have. Most of them, they're using a uh, smartphone already. But some of them is uh, in 2015, uh, but now increased. And usually, okay, we have two different foreign worker with what we call is the newbie and the old hand. The newbie is maybe before they came to Singapore and the other one is maybe they have already stayed in Singapore about more than one year so, and the habit is a bit different. Uh, okay, so for example like this, they give, we talk to them what they want to do, what they have, what they're thinking about Singapore, what they want to know. So in this one, it's not much they give about e-commerce, but we know that they need to spend after they work, tired already, they directly go back to the dorm, then they want to buy something nearby. So, okay. Because, uh, okay, so the communication preference, okay, because mostly they are India and Bangladeshi, they are, and they're using their own language, and the most, for the communication, they prefer to use a recording voice instead of typing because maybe it's more faster. Okay, so this is what finding uh, we, we, we found. What they are doing now, they, uh, monthly, usually they remit the money to the home. Now they, go, they must go to the remittance company. Uh, like in Little India, so many. Also in the Orchard Road, also they go there. They are not do it, doing with the bank. Because the bank, the currency rate is a bit uh, not good for them because a bit lower. So they buy grocery food also from the nearby supermarket. They're cooking themselves to help to save the more money. They buy gold in Little India. Workers return to the dormitory by bicycle, pickup truck or lorries, some work. So we are thinking also about to do uh, we call TPT pooling, so the like something like the bus, like Uber, but this is is for the bus. And Bangladeshi and Indian, the workers same uh, in the same apartment, they will exchange the recipes to to cook. So they watching Korean drama, local TV channel to learn English. And yeah, they visit Little India when they days off, having meal together at the restaurant spend a uh, day walking around the area and some of them they go to Mustafa but I think Mustafa is close already right yeah so close already 
so what I see in here is actually for the remittance company, uh, so for the remit the money to their hometown, this is the biggest chance that we can do. But now maybe we are competing with Singtel. Singtel have a dash, and some remittance company also they have the sum of uh, money uh, sending the money. And recently, I heard from Malaysia they have called Pundi X. This is uh, like a payment gateway, something like that. You can buy something, everything you pay. Even you can pay a cash, you can pay Singapore dollar, or even you can pay using a cryptocurrency like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and everything. So this is just the first one uh, launched. Uh, I think this week, yesterday, they just launched in Singapore. So for us, the, the biggest challenge is how they can pay to do the e-commerce. But last week, the Nets just uh, launched their new application. They call e -Nets. So uh, as long as you have, because foreign worker, the 82% foreign worker who come to Singapore, they have a POSB bank account. As long as they have the bank account, so they can connect to the Nets application, so they can pay. So the first problem I think we solved already with this eNets uh, payment. So we can we can see there is an, a chance that a possibility that foreign worker will start to do to buy something, but maybe not more than five to ten dollars one time, but maybe lower. So this is what we can do, and uh, we I would like to seek also the to to find out the more opportunity that we can do it also and like cooking everything maybe they cannot find some of uh, material so maybe they can find out from the e-commerce uh, thing because uh, we also planning to put in our own apps what is the commerce that we can do we found uh, try to find out lah, the, 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 the biggest so maybe I only have uh, 10 minutes for this one maybe a bit sorry Take your time. no because this also my last <laughs> my last pages so uh, I think I hope uh, with this gathering or event, we hopefully I can join this every time also for the next future. We can see or we can try to find out what we can do. But this one is more to for the business wise from the business side. Then I like to hear from Mel or VJ. Maybe we also can get some good idea information that we can combine together. I think this is. Uh, all from me maybe if you have any question or more can any we can have a chat together or maybe we have a FAQ here or after later yes if any institutions oh you want to make it now uh, yes, no, oh okay okay, okay. if don't have then maybe later we can do it yes, sure. yes. okay thank you thank you Yes. Uh, what stage uh, you are like? Uh, Sorry. Uh, what stage you are like that finding out the right e-commerce platform for the trade system, or what? Where where you are at the right right now? So finding the right e-commerce platform to 